Hey guys, it's Shar and welcome back to The Sims 4. So right now we are standing here with Miles and Zoe who is giving him some attitude because we forgot to pick up our son today, but we're going to go ahead and give her some attitude right back. Like, screw that. Like, we were going to pick up him later. Like, we have things that we need to do for our job. And she comes over here stalking us out, you know, like we're over here trying to mack on Eliza Thornberry over here And she's complaining about why we haven't picked up our son. I'm sorry. He was at school anyway <laughs> Anyways, um This outfit I have no regrets. I have none. I have zero F <laughs> to give um, so anyways, I'm going to have Miles get something to eat because he looks like he is a little hungry. Excuse me. You are standing between me and the kitchen. <laughs> Come on and get us some oatmeal and, um, goodbye. Goodbye. No, we don't, we don't care. Bye. <laughs> So China is over here too, just kind of beating the crap out of this punch bag. She is feeling really angry and frustrated right now and she's taking all of that out on this punching bag. Like she's stuck in a house with a guy that doesn't like her, another guy she had a baby with who's in a relationship with another girl. And look at, you know, we're angry. Let's just go over here and, and fight her. <laughs> Why not? You know, we're finally... You know, we're slim, we're looking good, you know, it's, it's, you might want to put some, uh, some athletic wear on though. Alright, come on China, come on, like, Don is standing right there, he surely loves a good fight. So, in the earlier parts of this LP, China got her freaking behind whooped by this girl, Caitlyn, and she finally kicked her butt. Yeah, you better be nice. You better be nice. Look at, oh, you know what? This game needs some tanning salons because you, sir, can definitely, can definitely use one. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I don't see you saying anything else, Caitlin. You better walk away. Yeah, you scared now. I done got my freaking workout on. These muscles is right. <laughs> like your armpits. Take a shower, like. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, so I'm going to go ahead and send China on home. So Miles is over here swimming right now, and um, he is he has to go to the bathroom, so I'm going to let him do that. So, oh, it looks like Zoe is in her towel. Well, we don't care, like. <laughs> but um, I went ahead and played a couple of days off of um recording because I wanted to get them a couple of promotions. So, um, Christian got a promotion and so did China. Um, it's almost Milan's birthday. Okay, cool. So, oh, Sydney's calling. Um, go ahead and pick up. Hey, Miles, it's Sydney. Do you want to go out on a date? Well, we was trying to use the bathroom, but okay. <laughs> so anyways guys I will continue once we get to the lot I was just about to say it and it is all over Miles face right now he's like please don't tell me you're pregnant please tell me that you stuffed the pillow under there <laughs> he's like but hey hi how are you nice to see you and um your extra stomach <laughs> <laughs> he is upset. Look at him. He is super tense. He's like, I, I don't, I don't think I, I want this right now. But anyways, um, let's go ahead and discuss some interests and um, let's go ahead and ask baby, do, the baby's due date. So it's obvious that Sydney wanted to hang out with Miles because she wanted to let him know that she was pregnant. So look at him. Look at him trying to say that. <laughs> Miles, you cannot sit here and tell her that you don't want to be committed when she's sitting here pregnant. <laughs> okay, so this is like the worst date right now for him. Like seriously, the worst date. Like he's just embarrassed um, from awkward encounter. She just wanted to really let him know what's going on and he's just like not really interested but he really needs to just get his mind off of things right now so he's just going to do what men do best and um build a couple of things and all of that jazz and where did she go where did she okay so she's over here so anyways i went ahead and played off camera and um and um Christian got a promotion as did uh, China. So Christian got a promotion to imaginative images. He makes $9 extra per hour. 
um, tolling 44 per hour. So he works nine to four now. China got promoted to minor crime lord. She also got some extra money, new clothes. She got uh, 32 per hour now. And um, she works Tuesdays to Saturdays, eight to two, which is good because she used to come home like really late. And look at her, she's just sitting there like, I'll wait for you. I will wait for you. I will wait for you until dawn. <laughs> <laughs> Has anyone played that movie yet? It looks so good. It looks so freaking good. But he's just like in here and she's just chilling like, you know, I'm just going to wait for him. I don't know what Miles has got himself into. I seriously do not. So why don't you go ahead and use the bathroom? I really feel like Miles is in over his head right now. Um, he's forgetting about his son and Zoe is not really happy about it. Now he has another baby on the way and he does care for Sydney. And while I was also playing off camera, he did have the whim to propose to her, and I don't know if it's going to come back again, but when I had came back in game, the whim was missing. But you know, that's just like him. I mean, he's just that type of guy, like he's into her, but then he's not, you know, like he's just, he doesn't know exactly what he wants to do. So right now it just seems like Miles and Sydney are having a okay date, but not the best date. I mean, he knows that she basically just brought him here so that she can tell him, you know, that she was pregnant. So we'll go ahead and fill the baby. And we're definitely going to be, um, you know, we're going to try to, to be a gentleman about it. And as you guys can see, like, their relationship is officially clashing because of everything. Like, she can see that he's really disappointed in the fact that she's pregnant. And the date didn't go well. She said, well, I guess this is goodbye. Um, Don't call me ever. Okay. So, I mean, you don't want to say that to Miles because he will really not call you. Like, and it's crazy because he went from wanting to propose to her to, I don't want to propose to her. And now they're like having a kind of friction between them and their relationship now because she's pregnant. So I really don't understand what's going to happen with him. I would love to see him settle down with someone he really cares about. So instead of him actually going to, to the house, I'm going to have him just travel and go over to Zoe's house so he can see his son and kind of basically apologize for not picking him up um, today. I mean, it's, it's Thursday. He was technically supposed to get home Friday night. She didn't drop him off. He should have picked him up after school. He didn't. So, <laughs> so, you know, it's just, it's parental issues. It's custody issues. You know, like, it's just, it's major issues, okay? Like, it's Miles J. It is Miles J. Like, that's just all him all the time. But once we get back to the lot, I will meet you guys when we get there. Hey guys, so we are finally here and I'm not sure why Zoe is outside her house doing some push-ups. Apparently, she's trying to threaten us. <laughs> and he would rather just sit on the bench. He's like, okay, well, I'll wait till you're done. <laughs> but we're going to go ahead and knock on the door because we're not here to see you. And, uh, and she knows it. Look at that. <laughs> she's like, well, I know you're not here to see me and you're not here to see your son either. Goodbye. You can knock on the door like a real man. <laughs> Oh my goodness, like, can you let me in, seriously? Alrighty, so we are here, and let's go ahead and see our boy who is off the bed. Like, look at that, like, he just missed an entire, an entire day with his son. Ask him about school, because we're really sorry that we didn't, um, hang out with you. So I was thinking that we will go ahead and, um, basically get Wendell on Thursday, and I'm going to try to, look at this, look, can you not? Can you not? I came over, didn't I? I came over. Like, stop scolding me. I'm hugging my son right now. You're really going to argue with me in front of my son? Y'all probably think I'm crazy. <laughs> like, I literally feel like I just be in this game. Like, you guys probably think I'm schizophrenic. Like, I have multiple disorders. <laughs> I, I'm telling you guys, I am I am as sane as they come. <laughs> and she is the one that's bipolar. Weren't you just yelling at us just a while ago? Like, seriously, get your life right. Like, get your life. 
So, um, let's go ahead and teach him a valuable lesson and, um, let's complain about local use and maybe his mom on top of the subject. <laughs> He's like, ah, yeah. <laughs> like, how dare you sit here and argue with me in front of my son? Like, you with this stupid behind toy, like, can he have more toys than that? <laughs> Don't talk to me. Don't talk. Do not. Don't talk to me. <laughs> do not. Can we brush her off? Like, um, insult, insult. Let's, let's insult your house. Like, okay, it's it's dark in here. It's nothing but red in here. It's dark. <laughs> um, let's, can we brush her off? Let's criticize. Nah. Because she did have that good woohoo at one point because that's how we got our son. <laughs> <laughs> so it is the morning time right now and the first thing miles had to do was wake up to her face <laughs> but he has to go ahead and take a shower really quickly and use the bathroom poor wendell is super tired as well well he didn't really get too much of a great night's sleep because his parents were up arguing and it's just not really good for him to see at such a young age and his father feels really bad about it and zoe is is um okay so she's over here like she could she look at she's just so reckless like look at look you know what For, forget it i i can't deal with her i cannot i don't know how miles did it <laughs> like seriously like i just i really feel bad for wendell though because he has to go to school with this weight on his shoulders and it's just it's not fair to him but he is living with us for the time being and miles is just over here taking his sweet time in the shower can you please hurry up he is also late for work and i need to have him grab a bowl of nothing because she don't cook neither <laughs> um let's see let's go ahead and grab some cereal she don't have a microwave like <laughs> you know what we are really considering just taking full custody of um window because this is ridiculous like he's super upset like the tv is on it's dark in here he has no toys like she's not washing dishes <laughs> she's just walking around prancing like she's cute and now she's just going to go to bed take a nap like i mean you are the worst like you are just the worst like just that that is all so i'm just going to go ahead and fast forward just a little bit so he's feeling a little bit better you know once you eat some fruit loops anyone is bound to feel good after you have that much sugar in your diet so <laughs> why don't you go ahead and go on to work i'm glad that miles is feeling a lot better and i am so curious to see how um, Zoe is going to react to Miles having another baby. But anyways, guys, I thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. And until my next video, I will see you guys all later.